going on? I guess Froggy had to leave. But since that worked so well, I thought it'd bring back Great Aunt Millie, Old Mr. Woodford, and Abraham Lincoln. <gasps> I forgot Lincoln's top hat. I love this holiday. Oh, no. What did we do? This is bad. We can't run a Great Aunt Millie or an Abraham Lincoln, and I have no idea who old Mr. Woodford is. But if we can't produce these people, Adelaide will know that Froggy didn't really come back. She'll be crushed. Well, then we have to bring them back, too. Hmm. Theo Carlos, would you mind helping me and Sid with our school play? Well, sure. What's it about? It involves Abraham Lincoln. Oh, four score and say no more. No! Oh! Huh, looks great. Just one more detail. Ta-da! Okay, now hop on. This is bad timing, but I have to go to the bathroom. Greetings, audience members. Wow, Abraham Lincoln, it worked. I didn't know what you like to eat, so I got you a hot dog. Ooh, I've never had one of these before, but I'll give Mary Todd the recipe. Well, hello there, dearie. Uh, it's me, Great Aunt Millie. Aunt Millie! Ugh. You feel lumpy. Thank you, sweetie. I've been getting ripped in the afterlife. <gasps> I've got your favorite perfume. <laughs> well, that was a great visit. <laughs> but I'd better get back to the gym. They don't call me at Tread Millie for nothing. Bye, Aunt Millie. <laughs> Hurry, get up there. I'm trying. You're facing the wrong way. Sorry. I'm still backwards. Adelaide, it's me, your old pal, Mr. Woodford. <laughs> Missed ya when I wasn't alive. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. 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 <laughs> Sid, I can't reach it. <laughs> Sid? Ronnie Ann? That's not Abraham Lincoln, and Mr. Woodford was a poodle. Right, now I remember. So that means Froggy was a fake, too? I hate Day of the Dead. <laughs> Wait, Adelaide, we can explain. Strange play. Ha. Good hot dog. Leave me alone, liars. We made it worse. What do we do now? What we should have done in the first place, go to the expert. Abuela, we need to talk to you. We really messed up. We gave Adelaide the wrong impression about Dia de los Muertos. She thought Froggy was really going to come back. And Aunt Millie, and Abraham Lincoln, and Mr. Woodford. Mr. Woodford? He's, He's a poodle. poodle. Ay, muchachas. She locked herself in her room. Can you help us? Hmm. Go away, Sid. It's not Sid, sweetie. I heard you are a little sad. Froggy never came back. Oh, but he did. He he did? Come down and see our altar, mija. And I can explain what Dia de los Muertos is really all about. Adelita, this is mi papa. Just like you miss Froggy, I miss mi papa very much. He liked bowling and tamales. But he was better at eating tamales. It's your own material. I honor my papa by putting out all the things he loved, and I use incense, candles, and marigolds to help guide his spirit back. So, where is he? Well, he's in my heart. You see, on this day, we think about our loved ones, and that keeps their memories alive. So even if we don't see them, they're still with us. Mm. <gasps> I do feel like Froggy is here. Ah! Senor Froggy? It's a Dia de los Muertos miracle. There you are. Little Stinker followed the trail of bacon bits all the way back here. <laughs> you guys keep talking. I'm good. <sighs> Abuela, this isn't Froggy. It's fake Froggy. <sighs> Pete, how about we make a trade? Tickets to my mom's gator tour in exchange for the frog? Put me in the splash zone, and we have a deal. Deal. Yay! <laughs> Thanks for saving the day, Abuela. You're welcome. I'm glad I could teach you about our family's traditions. Okay, everybody get together for a photo. 
<laughs> Look at the camera, Carlitos! Hey. Where's Carl? Phew! Finally, the last of the marigolds. Our ancestors will have no trouble finding our home. Now, where am I? <laughs> <laughs>